What is up guys, today we are back inside of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator, which is not actually totally accurate. <laughs> um, I'm just kidding, it's actually pretty awesome. Um, and it doesn't matter that it's not totally accurate, because it's just supposed to be a game for fun. So anyways, <clears throat> we are going to see which unit can, well, let, let's see if we can make an army to survive this. And also, I'm not done yet. <laughs> it isn't just going to be five rows of pikes. We're also going to have a row of poachers up here. <clears throat> a row of barrel rollers right here. And then we'll put the super peasant in the back. No, I'm joking. That, that would basically make the army impossible to defeat. Um, however, I actually have defeated him in the past. If you guys uh, saw my <clears throat> most recent video from yesterday. I actually did find out a way on how to beat the, um, Super Peasant without cheating. Um, so that was pretty awesome, because he's basically invincible. But this is going to be the army we're going to, that we're going to face off against. I, I'm also going to put two Super Boxers. Um, so, the rules that I'm going to restrict for this is I can use every single unit in the game except the Dark and Super Peasant. Because those guys just one-shot everything. So I can't use them. So, what I'm thinking we can do is to take out these guys in the front, like the Pikes. What we're going to do is we're going to make a tornado. And not just any tornado, a big tornado. So we're going to put some cheerleaders there. Then, we're going to have, actually I don't really want them there. Um, what else should we put? Um... I'll put four Reapers back here, because they uh, handle crowds pretty well, so they should do some work. We'll put some Skeleton Archers back here. Honestly, these are one of my favorite Archers, because one, they kind of explode when, um, when they die, but two, and this is the main reason, is that, like the name suggests, they have fire arrows. So, um, even when they die, the fire still burns the enemy. We're gonna have some quick draws, and, uh, some dead eyes. Okay, this is not even close to fair for me. And you might think, well, how is it not fair for you? Well, one, I have less units than them, and two, I have way less money spent than them. So that isn't all that fair. Um, should we try this? I don't think so. I think we need a little bit more. Now, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put some Samurais here. But we don't want it too close to Lady Red Jade. Otherwise, um, when she turns into a tornado, they're going to die too. But we have exactly 100 units, so let's do this. And I'm going to put this in slow motion, because otherwise it's super duper laggy. And uh, the Samurais just got one shot. Um, G-Leaders, why are you not turning her into a tornado? Okay, we're going to stop that, because that's not what I wanted them to do at all. Uh, I think it's because these dead eyes were too close to them. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, we're gonna take away the samurais because they didn't really do anything there. They just got killed. Um, and then I'm going to move the gunslingers back just so that way the, um, just that way the cheerleaders know exactly what they're doing, hopefully. But we're gonna put a row of gunslingers back here. And then we're going to put it back in slow motion. Okay, just use your power on... Just make a tornado. Why are you not making a tornado? Yes, thank you. You have made the tornado. I think that was a little bit late, but you made a tornado, and that's all that matters, and I think the tornado's already dead. Is the tornado already dead? The tornado died. Are you serious right now? Are you serious right now? Okay, we're gonna definitely have to retry this. <laughs> I just want to see a bunch of guns in the air, though. Like, bullets. <clears throat> because the gunslingers- Actually, the gunslingers might be able to do this. Because if they fire all- uh, Because they're gonna fire a ton of bullets. And I kind of just spam to them. So, what I'm hoping will happen is the tanks will blow up and then they'll hurt- the other team too okay yeah this is not working as i play up oh, wait the tanks are blowing up that tank blew up that tank blew up uh one of them over here blew up 
So it's just this tank left, I think. Or there's one over there that I still can't see because of how much, um, smoker. Okay, yep. Uh, there is one right here that just fell off the map. Or is falling off the map. So, uh, rip them. But, uh, actually, this might work. I think we got all the tanks. Except that one. Okay, yeah, never mind, we didn't get all the tanks. And I still think we have, yep, we have super boxers like, oh no. Guys, guys, he's right there. Just, just kill the super boxer. Why are you guys focused on other things? Oh, and we have a Thor. We have a Thor. That's just terrific. So we have two super boxers, a tank, and Thor to defeat. I don't think this army is going to do that. Um. I'm just gonna stop this because that is not going to work. Okay, if this works, I'm gonna be kind of depressed because this is just spamming gunslingers for what I'm going to do. Now, I doubt this will work because of the tanks and basically everything else here, except the pikes. The pikes we should act, <clears throat> the pikes we should be able to take care of easily, but I don't think this is gonna work. Uh, and the reason is, is because the tanks are just gonna, like, snipe all these guys. So then they're all gonna die. So I'll put some, actually, up front here, so that way the pikes use the thingies, and hopefully the tanks shoot them. Um, and then these guys have time. So we're gonna just spam gunslingers, and then hopefully they'll do the job, may maybe. This is the slowest fight ever. Okay, yep, there goes the first wave of bullets. There goes the first wave bullets. A uh, base. None of them are hitting. Almost none of them are hitting. The only reason most of these pikes are dead is because the tanks are just ramming into them. R really? Really, gunslingers? There's over 125 of you. Or there was. Some of you are now dead. Okay, actually, they might stand a chance, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we just have to deal with, like, ten Thors. Nope, eleven Thors, actually. And a few tanks. Some poachers. But otherwise, we're, we're good. Oh, and some super boxers. Uh, this, this one. I don't, I don't, he is just dodging all the bullets. I really don't know how he's doing that. I'm just gonna stop this here, because that did not work at all. Okay. Um, okay, we might just have to do my favorite strategy, and I don't know why this is just so fun to me, but what I do sometimes is I just scroll to the end of here, I take out Nuller, and then I go all the way back to where the cheerleader is, I just spam them, and then, and then the axes, it, it technically says he's throwing the axes, <clears throat> but if you look at his hands, they're coming back so fast that it looks like he's just standing there and creating axes. So we're just going to do this. Control him. Well, that didn't work. Okay, I think that would have possibly worked. It's just that we didn't have bait for them. So, they all just like one-shotted Uller because there was nothing else to attack. So we're just going to spam halflings. Okay, now we're good. Or we should be, at least. <clears throat> also, this is not working at... How do you guys get here so fast? That's... Okay, that... Yeah, that didn't work. Um... Yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do. I don't know how we're gonna beat this. I would just make an exact replica, but that's kind of just cheating, and then that would just come down to luck. Maybe, act actually, seeing how these guys never die. What if we just spam them against them? Maybe that will work. I doubt it, but maybe. <laughs> and I've officially broken the money. Okay, that's that's terrific. Okay, uh, 77 super boxers versus an army. Who will win? Who knows? I'm, I'm actually going to put this in normal mode. Because this should actually not be too laggy. Yeah, it's not too laggy. Oh, they're just like one-shotting the tank, so that's good. That is very good. Some of them are already dead somehow. I don't know how. We have we have a lot of them that alive though. 
We only have a few swords left. <laughs> it's just here. It's, these guys are the only guys left. It's just, it's just a crowd of super boxes versus like two Thors. Okay, they might actually stand a chance somehow. Okay, never mind, we won. Okay, I'm happy about that. Okay, we kind of cheated there, though. So, um, we'll try it again. I don't think this was really going to work out too well. We'll just spam Pirate Queens up here. We'll have 25 of them. We'll spam Skeleton Archers. Oh, not spam them, but we'll have a row of them, I should say. We'll also have Firework Archers. So that way everybody goes flying and no one can actually battle. We'll have Hotchas. <laughs> um, and then... Maybe some Ice Giants up front to absorb some blows for these other guys. And then, um, some Oolers. I don't know. Maybe, um... Maybe some quick draws and some dead eyes. Let's just let's just make a row of them. Uh, and then last but not least, uh, a row of reapers. How's this? If if um we have the quantity advantage but not the uh, money advantage. So um, will this work? I don't know. I really don't know. Okay, please say that the Pirate Queens will actually be able to get some shots off and not just get one-shotted by the Pikes. And... How does it... Oh, I, I thought that... I thought the Ice Giants died, but he was just blinking. I'm like, how does a tank one-shot an Ice Giant? That just doesn't make sense. But we have a rain... It's raining arrows over here. Because of the Watchers. So that's pretty awesome. The tanks should all die from these because that's like their one weakness. Watches. Um, so hopefully this will work. It might not, but hope up oh, they shot Why are you shooting your why are you shooting your allies? That that doesn't mean shoot the ice giants. It means shoot everybody on the other team. And I think some of them are dead. Oh wait. No, none of them are dead yet. Okay, that's good. That is good. All of my... Almost all of my ranged units are attacking the Ice Giants for some reason. I don't know why, but they are. Uh, we have just Thors left. I'm gonna put that back in slow motion. I tried putting it in normal, um, but it's, it's just too laggy. Okay. And, uh, they're just firing at the Ice Giants. Why are- what are you guys doing that for? I think one of them's dead because of you guys. Yeah, you killed one. No, you killed two. And you killed the last one, too? Oh, great, great. Now it's just ranged units versus Thor. That's just terrific. I think we can actually do it, though, because we do have the Watchers left. We actually do have some Reapers left now that I think about it. Pirate Queen survived somehow. I don't know how that happened. Um, it looks like we have only two Thors left to deal with. Maybe three. Just fire at the Thors. I want to see who's left. You have a pirate. Is this the only guy left on their team? No, that guy's left too. Okay. But are those the only guys left? I'm just going to do that and then do that. Um, then put it back in slow motion. Yeah, that, that's a good idea. Okay, uh, why are the arrows, oh, I am so stupid, I forgot that Thor could deflect arrows, okay then, um, I think we can see who, who's gonna win though, it's definitely gonna be the red team, so I think that's going to be it for today's episode, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new to the channel, or you want some more Roblox. Not Roblox. I keep saying Roblox. If you guys want some more totally accurate battle simulator, and everybody, peace out.